I'm Sophie and this is Lucas and we're going to take you on a virtual tour of our middle school. Keep in mind that with all this stuff going on, our building is in quite a disarray. We'll tell you what a typical day at Chilhowie Middle School is like and it's pretty awesome. Alright, so when you get off the bus, you come here for the lunchroom and you get to talk and you get to do homework and you get to eat breakfast before you go to school. As we come out of the cafeteria, to my left is the band room. Uh, this is where Mr. McFarland and Mr. Green are going to be. Hi, my name is Mr. McFarland, and I'd like to take this time to welcome you to Chilhowie Middle School. This is a great place to be. Uh, wonderful staff, wonderful students. Uh, I hope to see you very soon. I teach music and I teach choir uh, at both the high school and the middle school and we're happy to have you here. Uh, I'm new here too. I just started a little after Christmas uh, last year, so we'll all be new and, and get to know things together. Again, this is a wonderful place to be, and uh, thanks for joining us here at Chilhowie Middle School. Fifth graders, what's up? I'm Mr. Green, and I'm the music teacher, aka the band director at the middle school and high school. If you have ever wanted to learn how to play an instrument, um, if you sign up for my class, you'll get to do that. Um, if you're interested, contact Miss Gentry or myself, um, and we would be happy to get you put in band. Uh, hey guys, have a great summer. Hang in there. Can't wait to see you in the fall. On down the hall to your left, if you're this way, and to your right, if you're this way, is the nurse's office. This is where Miss Williams will be. Okay, so over here on your left is the auditorium. This is where we have the big assemblies. Okay, so right next to the auditorium is the library. It's connected to the middle school library, which is on down the hall. This is the main office. Keep in mind that school starts at 825, and if you are late, you can just come and sign the tardy slip thing, and yeah. <laughs> so, here is Mrs. Fitz. She's our secretary, and she's pretty awesome. I mean, anybody has this cool of a spinning chair is pretty awesome. Inside the office, you'll find uh, Mr. Lemon. He's our school principal. Okay, so the last room is Miss Gentry's in the office. If you don't already know her, she's pretty great. And she's pretty awesome because she's a spinny chair. Coming out of the office, we have room one. This is where we'll have uh, small assemblies and some of you will even have math class with Mr. Berry in here. This is Mr. Barry's room, and I don't know what we do here because I was sleeping through most of it, but I do know we have a TV, and this is where you'll get all of your announcements, and you'll, they even do trivia questions, and if you get the trivia question right, you get the chocolate bar, because I know I'm having a lot. All right, this is the eighth grade hall. This is where you'll find me and Sophie. And, and over here is the girls and boys bathrooms and it's in disarray because we've had with this coronavirus stuff we've had to get all of the student supplies. Now over here is Miss Carter's room. She teaches sixth grade special ed. She, she might be in some of your classes also. <coughs> Hey guys, my name is Miss Carter, um, and I am looking forward to working with you guys and helping all of you um, however I can. So look for me next year, and I'm looking forward to seeing all of you. There are a couple of classes you won't have that are in the sixth grade wing. Miss Powers is one of them. She teaches English. Dang it, it's empty. Directly across from Miss Powers' room is the sixth grade. The sixth grade wing. Um, these are the lockers. Um, the first exploratory class is Miss Server's class. It's keyboarding. Hello, incoming sixth graders. Welcome to the middle school. 
I'm Ms. Serper, and I teach uh, computer applications, 6th, 7th, and 8th, and for 6th graders that means keyboarding, and my class is the one where you will learn to type efficiently, and uh, don't worry about that because most of you uh, struggle with your typing when you first start, but by the time you get done, you'll be typing quite a bit better, and I can just about promise you that. Uh, as seventh graders, you'll learn more about different applications in keyboarding, especially the Google Suite. And also, as an eighth grader, you'll learn speech recognition, you'll use iPads, you will uh, do research, you will uh, do a lot of photo editing. So I've got a lot of interesting things for you to do. I'm looking forward to meeting you in person. And uh, as I said, welcome to the middle school, and we'll see you next year. Yes, Miss Server's class is really fun if the computers aren't broken. But the best part of the school is the bathrooms. You can't get any better than the bathrooms. First classroom we're going to talk about is the main class, and it's science. Miss Clark, can you do this? <laughs> okay, so after you get out of Miss Clark's room, you go to Miss. Mrs. Pierce from some of you will also have her for math. She's a really neat teacher. So, yeah. Hello, upcoming sixth graders. My name is Miss Pierce, and I will be your math six teacher next year. I look forward to seeing you in the fall. But the most important thing that I can tell you is that you need to know your math multiplication facts. You need to learn those. It will make your upcoming year so much easier if you will learn those multiplication facts and be ready to work. I look forward to seeing you and have a good summer. This is Miss Pierce's room is Miss Hopkins. This is where you learn all of your English, reading, spelling. Again. Miss Alice Hopkins' room, there's this computer lab. Anyone can use it for about anything. On down the hall, we have Mr. Corey Blevins' room. He teaches sixth grade history. This is Mr. Corey Blevins' room. This is where you learn about your history, your, the country, and it's a blast from the past. Hey, future sixth graders, my name is Mr. Blevins. I teach sixth grade history. Uh, it's U.S. History Part 2, so we cover from the years 1865 to pretty close to the present. Um, I just wanted to make this video to say hello. We're excited to see you. Glad you're coming into sixth grade. Uh, I know that coming into sixth grade can be kind of scary. Um, it's a new experience. You're kind of taking a step up in your education. Uh, that's pretty exciting, but again, also makes you kind of nervous. So we'll let you know that we're going to help you in whatever way we can. When I say we, I just mean all sixth grade teachers. We're going to help you uh, all that we can. Um, and I promise once you're in sixth grade for a few weeks, you'll be used to it. You'll probably enjoy it. Uh, hopefully you'll enjoy it more than elementary school. Uh, so I look forward to seeing you all in person, hopefully. Uh, I look forward to having each of you in class. Have a good day. Okay, so this is Mr. Pierce's room, the technology teacher. It's right next to Mr. Blevins. This is where you get to build cars, fly drones, build bridges. It's really, really, really cool. Hey everybody, I'm Mr. Pierce. I teach technology at the middle school. My class consists of things like computer-assisted design, the principles of engineering and mechanics, and a heck of a lot of fun. Have a great summer. I can't wait to see you in the fall. Our third exploratory class is art. We actually have a new art computer here. This is where you become the next Vincent Van Gogh. Hey, all of you rising sixth graders. My name is Miss Poole, and I'm going to be your art teacher this year. I'm so excited to have you. I can't wait to teach you this upcoming year. This is like a new boys and girls locker room, but you don't have to dress out. You just have to wear tennis shoes. Uh, some of you have gym all year round, and the band students will only have <laughs> two exploratory Rotations. Hey guys, I'm Miss Grinstead. I'm your health and PE teacher. I'm excited to teach you guys this year. I'm on top of the world! Hey. 
Hey, I'm Mr. Testerman. I'm a PE teacher here, and I look forward to seeing you guys. Coming out of the gym, we have the snack machine. Um, you have to have permission to get out of class to come to these to get a snack. <laughs> and um, this is the summer career hall. The only reason we'll be coming down here is for Spanish. Okay. So now, this is the seventh grade hall, which is a really sketchy neighborhood. So I wouldn't come if you absolutely had to, but if you do, you need to use the restroom because it's the most important thing ever in, in the school, trust me. And the other reason you would come is you'd go to, the, to Spanish. Now you come in this doorway and go all the way up these stairs. We've got a new Spanish teacher, so that sure will be fun. When you come here, you can always ask me and Sophie for help. You can ask Miss Gentry, Miss Fibbs, Mr. Blevins, any of the sixth grade teachers for help. And remember, make it a great day or not, the choice is yours.